Okay, we are recording a video. I'm testing out my GoPro Hero 7 8 or set Hero 7 Black. Let's see if it's can handle the bumps and whatnot. So here's Lancer, he's going to be helping me out with this little video. I'm going to explain um, kind of how I do my camera mount. Um, I didn't want to have to drill any extra holes into my car or try to do anything special because first of all, you can't use the traditional like suction cups uh, that would go onto a window because these are not really secure. Um, even if you have the top um, on, it's not that secure. It, it'll, it, it picks up all the vibrations. So this won't really help. So I thought, well, these, these seatbelt bolts go pretty far in. I'll bet you I could put another piece of metal um, in between those and still be, you know, safe and secure. And so I found these, they're slotted angled pieces um, that I had to drill out a little bit of the, of the on this side of down here, a little bit of the hole here so I could fit the, the bolt through. And this gave me a surface to bolt onto for my, for my frame. They also actually, ironically, make really good um, anchor points for bolt, uh, tying down stuff. If you happen to have to, to do anything really tall in here like I have in the past. This, this is, I've hauled dressers, I've hauled beds, I've hauled um, all sorts of stuff in here. You know, and having these there have been actually been very helpful. Um, that being said, um, here is my frame that I came up with. It's um, just regular uh, square aluminum tubing. 
and I drilled two holes on both sides so that they would build a bolt into here. And um, I have uh, I used to have washers, but they're not they're not showing here. But I'm gonna I'll show it to you after I get it installed. But um, then we made this little platform here for this thing. Now this thing is actually something I made up. Um, this is a piece of tubing that inside of it I've got another tube that's suspended uh, using what are called sorbethane washers. That's made made of this kind of a um, it's absorbing material that uh, is supposed to take up to like 90% of the vibration. Um, and inside this, I put a, inside this little tube, I put epoxy in and I, I secured a quarter 20 bolt. Um, and so I got one sorbethane washer here, one sorbethane washer here. So this tube is suspended in the middle of this outer tube. And then I put this tube on here so I'd have it to kind of have something to anchor it to and I use this U this U joint or this U bolt to um, secure it and uh, this uh, you know for my really cheap uh, action cam that I had it worked okay it's still there was still plenty of vibration that came through um, and but the thing that really ruined it for me for the action cam was the fact that the color reproduction was horrible and um, the image quality as you got toward the outer edges of, of the image um, faded and kind of distorted a little bit so I was always I've been always wanting to get myself a GoPro um, but I just couldn't afford one until now so anyway I've got uh, you basically used um, threaded rod for the length here and I just secured it with um, these are nylock nuts that will not lock it down and I use uh, these so that, that if I want to, I can disassemble this, but these are using um, wing nuts. So anyway, I'm going to put it together and uh, I'll show you how that put together. Okay, so we're going to put this over here and I'm going to get my washers. Okay, so there it is. It's, it's installed. Um, like I said, I might actually move this a little more center now that I'm going to be having a lot of more conversations with Claire in here. So she might, it might still work with her. I'm not sure. It's her. So here, so here it is with the GoPro installed. Um, <laughs> you can angle it however you want to and, and stuff like that. It was kind of nice. Um, so yeah. Well, in a nutshell, that's that's my little thing. Obviously, this isn't very incognito. Um, you know, you, you drive around with this, and everybody knows you're you're filming things. But that's the only thing I don't like about it. Um, I would like to have something a little more stealthy, but we'll see. Now, there is another place that some people mount things, and that's on this handle right here. Okay, so right here we're on on the on the frame. But there's another one that, that was back here that would be more like that. Um, it would be located right here. And so I could probably have it a little bit up higher. But that would be a pretty good pretty good view, I think, too. You can see the whole car. <laughs> well, you can see the back seat and everything. Um, and you can see a lot more of what you're driving, you know, what, what, what's surrounding you. Um, and that's this one right here. So I like this a lot. So I might actually try to find that thing because this is a lot more kind of stealthy uh, than having this big, huge frame here. But um, either way, I'm not really, not really that picky. It's just fun to be able to have some footage of me driving my car. Um, thank you, Lancer, for helping me out make this video.